So coming up is a packing video of myself and just decluttering my room, my college room that has been there for a year. It's going to be an exciting journey, so come along with me. Hi everyone, welcome back to another YouTube video. It is your girl Lin Wei and there's absolutely no way without going through the way and we believe that Jesus Christ is the way. I am so emotional so I just got back from Carol's and half of everybody that I know at church has found out that I am not coming back next year. I'm going to KZN and I'm obviously very excited for this new journey that God is taking me on and I'm just excited for everything and I was an alpha Carol it was so amazing it was so awesome i really enjoyed it and my as you can see i enjoyed it so much because i've had these nails for almost like uh because i had these nails before my last exam and then today i was dancing my way out as a little tiny elf and i lost my little pinky so now i'm just gonna take off all these nails and yeah i'm back in my room so i wasn't in my room this entire like the previous week um and i was just like with my church family and friends and just trying to settle down and everything because i found out that i'm not going to be in cape town next year on wednesday last week so a lot of emotions have been going up and running but yeah and i realized that graduation is in two weeks time so i have to start packing my room and my room i'm going to show you guys how my room looks at the moment before i start packing and i'll obviously document the whole process because this has been a very special time in my life i've enjoyed every single moment of it and i'm so excited as you can see my eyes are so tired um i drink an energy drink to to be exact so i had it like <laughs> my eyes are just opening up because i'm trying to be like don't fall asleep on the camera but yeah, that's basically where I am right now. Am I excited to go to KZN? Yeah, but is my Zulu fine to go to KZN? <laughs> because like I've been in Cape Town for so long, I've been speaking like English every single day. Even when I go back home, my family says my Zulu sounds weird. So, and now I'm gonna be in KZN every single day that's just gonna be so hard I, it's, I don't think it's gonna be hard like I understand the language which is what I'm excited about and plus I won't have to deal with a lot of racism because most of the people in the hospital are my skin color so that's just gonna be awesome I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm more excited about that and yeah because I mean especially when you spend four years in a space where 95% of the time when people speak in Afrikaans you don't really fully understand like I get stuff but I don't get the whole story so yeah I'm just falling down and down and down the more uh, but yeah, I'm just gonna start packing. I'm gonna record this entire thing on my phone because I need to get used to recording on my phone because the camera that I've been using this whole time was not mine. It was a borrowed camera and this is like a very sentimental camera so I can't take it with me to case it in. So it's, I'm gonna take it back to the person this coming week. So the previous videos, <laughs> that quality, that's the last time you're gonna see it. Maybe next day I'll buy myself a camera when I'm like, earning but it's not it's not yet a priority for me to get myself a camera like that as long as my phone can still create content i'm a, a, a okay so i'm going to show you guys my room because i'm starting to blab I feel like i'm talking so much but don't forget to like comment share and subscribe i'm using my voice also so check you guys later so this is the current situation right now these are all the boxes that i got from um where i was and that's like my bathroom um, I haven't been in this bathroom for a week, so it probably is weird now. And then this is my room at the moment. My flowers also haven't been watered. I need to clean that stain. This is from like September when I had like the ball. I was spray painting stuff. So no, it wasn't September. It was the camp in October, but that was that. Then this is my room. So this is like every single thing that needs to be packed. Tomorrow I have an induction. Um, I'm attending it because it's my last one and I never attended one because all the ones I've attended were online. So the other, this one's gonna be in person. So everything in here, oh my word, there's so much, needs to be in those boxes that are outside. So let's get started. I think if I recall properly, like my first step was to uh, clear out my cupboard. And I con was constantly distracted distracted throughout this entire packing process for one reason only i was watching how to get away with murder it is so amazing oh my word just 
you know Shonda Rhimes I will I will recommend this woman to every single person like she's an incredible writer she knows what she's doing and yeah but that's besides the point let me refocus on what I'm talking about here so I was picking up um so hey everybody today is day two of my packing I am holding my camera so if you're seeing my hand it just means I'm holding my camera simple but anyway um yeah it's about to get a little hectic because I came back from the induction and then I was very tired and then I just ate then I did my hair that's what took time so now my room the only parts that I've been able to finish was the books well I haven't finished the books there's still more books lying all around this place so I'm just gonna quickly do that and I'm gonna oh my, my one of my friend bought me a graduation gift so I'm gonna open it I thought I was I, I wanted to wait until graduation but then I'm getting impatient so I'm gonna open it now before I start packing <laughs> So I just continued with my packing and I remember finding like some really, really old poetry and books that I've read, some of my journals. It was just such an incredible reflection moment for me when I was going through all this stuff. And then you see me taking out my prayer wall. This has been my lifeline. When I say lifeline, I mean everything and anything and more. I just think next year I'm going to become more defined at it. So I had like so many different things that needed to be like packed out and just as you can see my medication i was a very sick student in my final year but that's attributed to a lot of different stuff so i just packed everything all together so this was still me packing stuff around my desk area because there were quite a lot of stuff to pack um and then i sat down to tack finally tackle my clothes and i was watching how to get away with once again still watching it like it's very great but anyway <laughs> this is my second time i'm actually saying this um so i was obviously like going through my clothes taking out some that i'm going to donate and some that i'm going to keep because i can't really take everything with me it's going to be a new season it's going to be an exciting time so you can see me just like ravaging through all the clothing and just packing there i was separating my scraps from the rest of my clothing and yeah it was going very well then the next day i woke up i think this was the day before um Auto taking and I was just packing up everything as you can see my hair's already been done already and I was just trying to finalize all the items that are at the top and I was getting very confused about what I want to keep what I want to give away and just distracted by what I was watching again um, so I packed everything up and was boxing it in it was a very interesting experience I know it's 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 going by so quickly as I'm watching it but it took me very long to pack up my room it took me about a week approximately and plus i would go away and come back and it was a whole complicated procedure but over and above all it was an enjoyable experience because like you get to reflect and see how far you've come so i had taken out the things that i was going to need that i was going to pack with me or like clothing i'm going to wear for that week so it was packed away from everything else um but that's just me again just taking out all the glasses i had a lot of glasses i'm so scared that my glass is going to break when i get to newcastle guys i am going to like show you guys whether my glasses broke or not we're gonna unpack together what do you guys think just comment in the comment section let me know so i changed the angle here so that you can see but as you can see i was watching something as well well i watched a lot as you can see. i got very distracted looking at looking back at this is like mm, look at how many times you got distracted bro focus 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 you are cleaning focus <laughs> clearly she doesn't hear me but um it was very fun and i moved to picking up my glasses and my containers which are also a lot like i have a lot of things for a student i know that some people's packing wouldn't look like this at all the situation in my room right now guys this is a disaster i tell you but there's so much progress i think i'm gonna be done by the end of today so this was me immediately after all the taking i think yeah because i have the wig on now and i had done someone else's hair before then and then i was just packing out all of this and i was like in the final stages because i had even had like lifted up the bed like everything was completely done so i was like trying to see how many boxes i have what i need to carry and stuff like how am i going to look for like you know packing services which were also hectic if you guys want a separate video for me talking about that just let me know in the comment section and yeah this was basically I the end of the run and my friend was Christmas helping me take the boxes day. downstairs and and this was him just picking all of them up because basically he just said i want to let you go down by yourself and this was me just giving you guys a last final tour of my own room i did go up 
the, 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 the table to show you the room from the top Girl. view uh, because I did it's think it looked nicer natural. and that is a very strong table you guys I can, I can safely and confirm I that it is safe but anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this long awaited video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and let me know in the comment section how you guys are feeling about me and this move Thank you.